Hi. Um, okay, video number two. Um, this might be my last one for a little bit. I might do another one later today, but I'll be busy after this for a little bit. So, um, okay. Retro cat fights. Um, I did. I I thought about doing this because um, my cat fight videos, soap so cat fight videos, have been doing really well. So, um, I figure I'd switch it to retro soap. Um, all right. When I say retro, I mean all my children and one life to live in Port Charles, um, which is a spinoff of uh, General Hospital. And the main difference with um, Port Charles is because uh, they had only half an hour episodes and they did everything in a book, like a 12-week, 13-week story arc so they'd finish they do the book finish it and move on to the next book um all right i i like that because there was continuity which i'm a big fan of and also you didn't know what you're getting yourself into kind of and it was like a um it was kind of like a hodgepodge every day you didn't know if you were going to get people fighting with each other, people in love, people trying to stab, you know, or, like, mysterious creatures. So, that element of it was there. Um, I just like the soap a lot. I wish they had let it keep going. Um, but, thankfully, I think most of the actors who were in that soap moved on to other things. So I always like that. Um, all right. So cat fights. All my children. Well, <laughs> the first one that comes to mind is Susan Lucci. And Susan Lucci played Erica Kane. And you have to remember that the character was married nine times. Maybe ten. Because she also did repeat marriages to the same people a couple times. Like she was married to Jackson at least twice. And... Uh, I think there was someone else a couple of times. Uh, so there were 10 all together. Um, so she's probably fighting with another woman, like Opal or something, about a husband. Um, that happened a lot. And also, this isn't, uh, this isn't a cat fight, but it was like, I'd say the most awkward slash poignant moment of a soap opera um when uh bianca eden regal bianca montgomery came out to her mother as a lesbian um she was one of the first lesbian characters on a soap opera and also to be erica kane's daughter and she's a lesbian um that was huge um of course now gay and lesbian characters are not a big topic because although they don't get much representation as they should, they get more representation than they have in the past. So, although, which this is current, so I wasn't trying to go here, but Tariya, um, Mariah, and Tessa, they didn't get any uh, stories during Pride Month, which I find very interesting. But okay, that was a side note. Um, all right. So, oh, and then also, um, for Soap Cat Bites, One Life to Live, Vicky and Dorian. Okay, we're talking about Erica Slazak and, um, geez, Robin... Strasser, Strasser, um, yeah, okay, oh, you want to talk about some cat fight, okay, every couple of months, or maybe every couple of years, it depends on the storyline, but there was always a cat fight, and uh, they had an interview with Erica Slazek at some point, and she said those are the most fun to see, scenes to film, because behind the scenes, she and Robin were friends, and so, to play enemies like that was just great fun. And 
they never did anything to physically hurt each other. Like any kind of move they did in the blocking. This was back in the days when they did blocking before shows. They would always check with each other and say, okay, it's okay if I do this move. Okay, make sure you do this when I do this move so you don't really get hurt. So, um, yeah, those were cat fights. Um, also, um, Greenlee, I guess all my children, um, Greenlee with, um, uh, Ryan, she was married to Ryan, but she got into some cat fights too. Greenlee Smythe, played by the amazing Rebecca Bunny. But yeah, she got into some scrambles herself. Um, yeah. Um, yeah, so. I mean, I'm sure everybody, like, if I were to go down the list of soap operas, I'm sure you could find a cat fight in any soap. But those were the most notorious that whenever someone would say the name, the two names together, everybody kind of goes, oh, yeah, those were outrageous. So that's what I was looking for in this video. Um, all right. Bye, guys.